when they see uh, pros in this industry who are making like millions every year. Welcome to High Talks with Mushta Bayaman and Himanshu Gupta once more and once again. We are here and we need you to like the video first. Subscribe to us, okay? Like right now. Drop a comment right now and get the notification bell on. Otherwise, we're not starting. We'll wait for two seconds. Sorry. Okay. So guys, today we are covering Nitish Mitter Singh. Yes. What's up with him, bro? So first of all, he's the founder and joint managing director at Nazara Nazara Technologies. Ooh, big guy. Very big guy. <laughs> and uh, this is his statement uh, in regarding uh, in regards to esports, um, mobile gaming specifically, and specifically within India. So he said that the, India would be the top country in terms of consumer spending on gaming over the next four or five years. And this is in line with the growth that we're seeing in India. However, like at the moment, if you see in terms of spending, mm -hmm. India is not at that level. And yeah. the reason being is that people started with casual games, right? Mm -hmm. A Candy Crush, yes. for example. But now since the dynamic is shifting to more social games, right? More competitive games, we could see a rise in this. Actually, people started with uh, the same farm bill, I think. Facebook games. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Facebook brought it here. <laughs> and uh, now this shift is happening. So down the line, over the next four or five years, we can see a fast, a vast increase in the commercial success within the region. No, hundred percent much. Uh, like it's it's well known that India has been one of the biggest markets for mobile games. Yeah, it's the highest uh, in terms of Google Play Store and App Store downloads. Correct. So it was going to happen overall, mm -hmm. right? Uh, that's what Mitterson said as well. Mm -hmm. We we are the biggest players. And the industry is growing. Mm -hmm. We're still having more kids. Population, which pata nahi hai. <laughs> Bad year population. Mm -hmm. So population badegi, or bachcha aenge, or bachche games khelenge, or economy badegi. It's all about politician. <laughs> politician against the one child <laughs> <laughs> ban. Uh, so yeah, like overall, it makes sense. Yeah. Right? So right now there is again a gap between consumption, as in the number of players. Mm -hmm. And the number of players who are monetizable or who are being monetized, hundred percent, right? So this is because in India it's majority of mobile games, mm -hmm. right? Compared to if you look at uh, America, where mm -hmm. PC gaming, console gaming is the way, right? So to play a console game, what do you need? You need to buy the game first. You need a console first. You need a console, of course. <laughs> yeah. yeah, no, that's a good point. Uh, so, mobile game, you have your phone. You're anyways going to get a phone. Yeah. Right? You want to check your socials. You want to make calls. It's not a want yeah. anymore. It's a need. Yeah. So, here you actually buy a console. So, now you're in a different bracket altogether. Yeah. On top of that, then you buy the games. Then, if you have to buy things within the games, you know, you have that ability to do so. Because you're already experiencing that spending pattern. At that point, you're already a very niche category, mm -hmm. a niche player right, who's gone all the way, whereas with the mobile it's just a general board. Yeah, so that's the reason why it's not seen as yet, but you know, as people are moving away from casual games to more competitive games, more social games, this arbitrage will be covered. I think everyone, once they see how the esports players are actually rising, mm. when they see uh, pros in this industry who are making like millions every year, I think that will motivate everyone. Mm -hmm. That will make them push it because like one thing I understand is whenever someone starts or whenever industry starts off the players like players as an individuals who come up they obviously make some amount of money they're making some kind of they're getting some kind of traction with the public mm -hmm. at that time they hate it but once they reach a stage mm -hmm. that's the time when people go like oh shit I could have been better. yeah and that's and that's the time when people will be like okay let's start a stream and I think that that time is now. Mm -hmm. It's happening already. There's no stopping it. Mm -hmm. We know millions of, like not millions, but like the thousands of this thing streamers, casters who are trying to get up in the industry. And one way, the best place to do it is with high tournaments. Join us. Your game, your revolution is our reality. Perfect, right? Yeah, that's facts. That's facts. He's uh, facts. So yeah, guys, uh, thank you so much for coming on to High Talks today. It was a uh, short and cute video. And we'll see you tomorrow. Shabbat Ali.